If you decide you need a stack to help you solve a programming problem, your temptation might be to write your own stack class. But the one available in the Java Utility Library is extremely useful and is full-featured. And you can save a lot of time and effort by using the standard one. We're going to discuss the standard stack class in the Java Utilities Library in this video and discuss its main features. Here are the main methods available. We can see we can call a method to see if the stack is currently empty. The peak method allows us to look at the top element in the stack without removing it. The pop works just like the peak, except in addition to returning the top element, it's also removed from the stack. The push allows us to put a new element onto the stack, and the search allows us to look for an element anywhere in the stack. There are some other methods, for example size, which we'll be using later on in this lesson, which are also inherited. Uh, this is inherited from the parent class for stack, which happens to be Vector, another standard class in the Java Utility Library. Let's have a look now at a basic implementation and some. Uh, let's exercise some of the features inside this standard stack class. So in this programming shell, I've imported the Java Utility Stack uh, class from the Utility Library, and I've created a main program. And the first thing I need to do is create a new stack. And we're going to put some elements on the stack now. The stack can now be printed just by throwing the whole thing into a print statement. Let's run this now. And here we see that the stack prints just like an array. Uh, if we were to take off the top element, for example, and print it, we see that the 3 has been uh, removed from the stack and is being printed here. And if we were to reprint the stack now, we see that the 3 is no longer there. Instead of doing a pop, if we just do a peak and we run this, you can see that it still shows us the top element, but this time if we were to reprint the stack, you see the 2 is still uh, left on the stack because the peak, unlike the pop, does not remove the element. We can also ask the stack how many elements are inside of it. And here we see that the uh, size method is telling us that there are currently two elements on this stack. So those are the basic features of the standard stack class in the Java Utility Library.